When you're going to undertake to do any play, you need two things in my mind. Is that you need to work with people of talent. And what the Magic has is this great group, this great core of very, very talented uh, people. And you also need a kind of willful belief. You have to believe in it because it doesn't pay and it's impossibly hard. And because uh, there are you know, no uh, rewards outside sort of doing it right. Those things are really rare to find in the same place. And the Magic is one of the few places that has, uh, has both. I am Margaret Whitney. I'm complete. I'm a fortress. The only guarantee I come with is I can survive anything. I feel like I go to the theater to learn how to be a better person. I go to learn something about humanity, about myself, about the world around me, and I think it's because it's posed in a question. And great theater does that. <laughs> Tomorrow I'm gonna be released. I'll say goodbye right before I go, not one minute before. One cold, quick, quick to the heart, that's the way it works in here. Why do you wanna be in the way? I wanted to make something new, something that no one had ever heard. It seems to me that the magic has a certain authenticity in the its mission and its practice. There, there's a sense that the magic is where the playwright's voice is uh, is really heard. Oh God, the king! Oh! William? Oh. I thought you were dead. I will be if you don't help me. God, you feel good. You're an outrage and a scandal. The work that they that they do here, it it forces and it encourages and challenges the actors, but also it challenges the audience to really think outside the box and, and push the parameters of their heart, of their soul, and just keep exploring who we are as individuals. I know I was once in prison. I'm out. I am on probation. Damn it, man. You should do like your brother.